few days. <laughs> so the last press conference, uh, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> it looks nearly like it has been the whole week, <laughs> at least in the middle. <laughs> Tura, uh, tell us about your race. Oh, uh, it uh, feels not so good in in the track today, but I was doing uh, great uh, also today in the shooting range and. Yes, it was very good until the last uh, last shooting, and I won this penalty there. Uh, it's not so good. I f it feel felt feel so not so good today, but it's okay to have. Uh, yes, this, only one. <laughs> the shooting form you have uh, is it like uh, something uh, that suddenly can disappear, or is it something that you have for a long time? I mean, this feeling. Uh, you, you must be very uh, sure when you come on the range nowadays. No, it looks like that. <laughs> no, I have to fight for all the for all, all the targets. So uh, I don't feel it. Uh, I think I have to do uh, work hard also now, and when uh, the uh, shape the shooting shape is good. <laughs> Three victories in uh, in uh, three races. Are you changing any of your goals for the season? Is it still the overall World Cup and the World Championships? Uh, yes, I think it's still the same. <laughs> Were you in any way affected by the cold weather today? Oh, that was okay. I was not cold at all, so it was yes, no problem. So I guess with this form you would like to continue competing every day next week also, or <laughs> do you take a few days without competition now? <laughs> Yes, I think so. <laughs> Maybe I have to take a test for myself. <laughs> no, no. What are you going to do the next week? Uh, tomorrow I will go to Hofhilsen and then I will t uh, take a little bit easier day, training days before the next uh, competition. After just winning and winning, do you feel more pressure or do you feel more self-confidence after each race now? Yeah. I don't know <laughs> what I feel, but I will try to do the, my best and, uh, in the next races also. What were your thoughts uh, when you started today? You had uh, quite a good lead, but not too much. Uh, I, I'm not sure what I was thinking. I was uh, thinking to do my own races and not think so much about uh, the others. And I think I do it uh, really well. Typical athlete in form, they don't think about anything, they just do it. Hofilsen, <laughs> is that a venue that uh, you normally are good in? Uh, no. <laughs> no? <laughs> but I will try to do it, do it better this year. <laughs> okay, uh, Dasha, uh, second place today. Uh, was it any time of the race where you thought you could uh, take Tura? Mm, I don't thought about Tura also. I don't thought about Tura or about somebody other. Uh, yeah, I made my race and nothing more. Are you satisfied with the overall result in Östersund this week? Uh, yeah, it was quite good races and uh, yeah, maybe not all things was perfect, but I have to work and yeah, it's a challenge for me and I like it. What do you have to work on in the coming weeks? Yeah, all things together. <laughs> But only one penalty today, it's good shooting? Yeah, it's good for me, yeah. It's, and in this cold, cold condition, uh, I felt also not optimal my fingers. But yeah, the result of the shooting was quite good. Is it, do you feel a little bad that you had not beaten Tura here? She's I think unbeaten. the season is <laughs> quite long and we all have good fight. <laughs> But uh, you consider Tura your biggest opponent now in the overall cup this season, or will there come uh, other yeah, girls? Yeah, for sure. Uh, Tura is one of the strongest, but there's also some other athletes who, yeah, who can win and who can fight with us. Today, uh, every lap you took a few seconds in the beginning, but you lost a couple of seconds at the last part of each lap. Was that something you did on purpose, or was it? Wh why was it uh, like that? I felt my ski not uh, perfect today. Um, feelings on my body and my shape was good, uh, but uh, yeah, I said uh, before that uh, this uh, cold weather condition is really difficult for our waxmans to find some good wax, and. 
yeah, we are really glad that we go to some warmer place. <laughs> yeah, and you said you were freezing. Did you freeze during the race also? Yeah, I had problems with fingers. Then it's good to shoot only one miss. <laughs> I'm really glad. <laughs> and Andrea, you shoot zero misses. That was an experience racer's result. I noticed you took a little longer time than normal on the range today. Uh, yeah, um, especially standing, I think. The third standing, I had a little trouble to come in the right standing position because my ski every time was slipping away. And so I just took my time. And yeah, it was worth it to do it, I think. Uh, first time on the podium this season, but probably not the last. Uh, how, is, how has your preparation been before the season compared with all the other years you have been on the tour? Um, this, is, this year was better than last year when I had some trouble with my body. But um, this year I could train good and uh, we didn't prepare for being in the perfect shape here. We want to be, as uh, we want to have the good shape um, at the beginning of next year in January, February. And yeah, so far so good, I would say. And hopefully, I also hope that it's not the last time for me on the podium. When, when was the last time you shot zero in a pursuit? Do you remember that? Maybe it was here, a few years ago. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. I, I remember that I did it here once. Uh, about the race, you had a hard fight with uh, Dasha. Did you uh, ever thought you could beat her today during the race? Oh, I was just thinking about um, how I can handle this for myself at the moment. And uh, yeah, I tried the best at the shooting range. Took my time, how you said it already. And I was just happy that I had to fight with nobody in my last loop. Did you have any problems with the cold weather? Um, yeah, I'm freezing pretty fast, but I think over all these years I can handle it better and better and I have my little tricks already, so I was fine during the race. How are you as a team, a German ladies team, satisfied with this opening World Cup without Neuner in the team? Um, yeah, we have, now we have a podium, that is good to have every time. and. We know Lina lost big steps behind, and we cannot maybe fill it completely, but we do our best to fill it as good as possible. How was it to start again without her uh, when you started the training for this season? Did you f miss her in the team, or? That during the season it was not so big, big difference because sometimes I wasn't there, sometimes she wasn't there for to train. She did a lot of things by herself last year already. Um, so it was just like it was with everybody else who lost me already. <laughs> so what's your biggest goal of the season? Is it the World Cup or the World Championships or something else? <laughs> yeah, my coach said I should not think that I can be in a good shape for four months anymore. I'm too old for this. So <laughs> I take my focus for the World Championships and hope another time for a single medal. Okay, <laughs> that was an interesting one. Some questions to the three on the podium. Otherwise, uh, congratulations. Thank you very much, all of you. Sweets.